Question number two, self-assessment. We need to identify where you are right now with your confidence levels. So what I would like you to do, I would like you to take a pen and paper, if you don't know what it is, something like that, pen and paper, and make a circle. Make a big circle and split the circle into seven sections. Seven sections. So you have like a pizza, yeah? Imagine, it's like a pizza. And now I want you to write into each section those areas. The area number one, health. Area number two, wealth. Area number two, three, finances. Area number four, relationships. Area number five, body. Area number six, spirituality, how you are with yourself as a spirituality. And area number seven, growth. Write it down. The thing is, this is just an example. You can do it with any areas in your life you want. You can create your own disc. You can make five pizza slices. You can have 10 pizza slices. It's very optional, it's up to you. I'm just making it up, which it's very transferable to many of you who are doing this course right now. And, and now you have the scale from one to 10. One is the lowest and 10 is the highest. And I want you to write the, down the number to, next to each area, how you feel you are in that area when it comes to confidence. So for example, with health, are you eating healthy? Are you taking care about yourself? How do you look like? Is it showing on your body? So if you are very good with eating habits and you are killing it and you don't eat anything bad, you don't drink alcohol, you don't drink coffee, you are very good on the top with health, you would write 10. Your confidence would be 10, but you would know it. You would know it inside of you that you are that good. But maybe if you are building a business and you are sometimes going for a takeaway and after you don't feel very good about it and you are like, you know inside of you that they, you're like, ah, oh, I shouldn't eat that. And your confidence is like telling you something different that you are actually doing, you might write number five. I don't know. I want you to write into each area a number where you are right now. So stop the video for a moment and come back to it. Okay, now you are back. I hope you did the exercise because this is just one exercise which is in here inside of the course and we'll have more and more exercises as we go. But the thing is, now, I want you to find two or three areas where you are eight or above. Find the two or three areas, or it can be maybe one area, I don't know, it depends on you, but there'll be definitely one area where you'll be eight or above. Okay, and now we want to focus on this area. Try to think about it. Why are you feeling so confident in this area? Tell me. Let's show it an example. For example, I'll just imagine you are a fitness person. Maybe you really take care about your body and your health. So your health is eight, your body is 10. You, you are going to the gym five times a week, you are eating nicely and everything is going nicely. So the thing is, your confidence is really high because you know it, you are looking good, you can show in your body, you are going to those beaches like I am now, I'm shooting this course from Tenerife, from my holidays because I have some time, and it really shows, it really shows. And because it shows, you feel confident, you feel good, yeah? You feel good. And how we now transfer that to the different area? That's the question. But try to think of what is it you are doing right now in this area that it feels so good it feels that your confidence is level 10 what is it you are doing and let's talk about it in the next session